hello and welcome to happy camper life um i just wanted to do an update video because i haven't done one in a minute and uh anyways it's summertime um alive and well out here at the rv park with the bugs the deer and the rattlesnakes um yeah i have to i don't know how a rattlesnake sounds so i had to look it up on the computer and um, it does sound like a rattle, it's kind of scary. And I had to do that today because Tyra, uh, I was trying to, she's on her medicine because we drove in from um, Lubbock. It was six hours, so she has her medicine. And there's a bug on the computer. And anyways, she wouldn't go over by the trash can. And then I heard this like, um, kind of like a rattlesnake. <laughs> I couldn't tell if it was and so she, she wouldn't go over there. I would go over there. So my trash is still here. Um, and so anyways, it was scary. So I looked that up. So that's the one thing I'm just kind of like, oh no, you know, the rattlesnakes. Everybody's been telling me to get a rattlesnake kit, bite kit, bite first aid kit. I'm like, oh no, but I really need to go get one. This is for real. And, um, I think that if the temperature drops like dramatically for some reason, like if a cold front comes in, I'm afraid that the snakes will come and like want to get on the concrete out here and stuff. And I don't know, it's scary. Um, so yeah, that's one thing. And then, uh, I have to buy some stuff to, uh, do a coating for the underbelly. So I'm going to have to do that. It's called an undercoating, I guess and do all that. I don't know how much that's going to cost, but I'm going to have to do that in the next month or so. Um, what else is going on out here in the camper? Everything's good. I still need to get a little couch. I'm supposed to buy my friends from, um, for me. I hope to do that, but um, the only other thing about living in the camper is with Tyra, so it's been like maybe almost three months, and she, um, her and I are just too close together. So, um, she gets irritated, I get irritated. Sometimes she doesn't want to come up the stairs. So I have to pick her up and she's 60 pounds. <laughs> she's like, I don't know, get scared or paranoid about the stairs. So sometimes I have to pick her up and bring her in. Oh, and um, the wind blew my direct TV thing down. It died. And, um, and now I can't get um, my TVs busted and it won't work. And so I called the RV park owner to see if he would come over and fix it. And um, he says broke and he can't fix it. So no TV. But I can watch Hulu online sometimes. But most of the time I only have like three, two or three bars. That's air fun. Um... And I've had some other visitors, people come and visit me. And so when people come and visit me, um, I just notice that when other people are in here with me walking around, you can just hear like every step. And I guess that's because how high we are off of the ground. So that's kind of one of the downers. But one of the good things I think about having it so high is that it's above everybody else's in the RV park. And so I want to get a ladder to screw into the back of my camper so I can climb up there and watch the sunset, yeah. So that would be really pretty. Um, and since mine's taller, I can totally see. And it was gorgeous today. I watched the sunset from the bridge outside of town. It was awesome. But if I had a ladder, I could crawl up there. And um, I would love that. You like if me and my friends could get up there and eat and watch the sunset that'd be pretty or drink some beers but we couldn't get drunk because then we'd have to get down down the stairs hmm. um but yeah so that's it all, all that's going on um yeah please leave me some comments and if you have any questions let me know but so far so good hope everyone's doing right cheers